friends and welcome back to a Brag Mini Adventures video. I'm your host Rose and today we are on Marco Island, Florida. It is a four by six mile island off the southwest coast of Florida and it is currently the place we're staying while we wait for our van to get built. Now, as we do this waiting, we have contacted some amazing tour companies here on the island, and today we are meeting with Trike Tours USA to take a little tour around some of the hot spots and the beautiful landmarks with a local guide. This is one of the very few on-land tours offered, so I'm incredibly excited to see what there is to learn. Even though I come to Marco a lot, I am not actually a local. I don't live here, or at least not until now. So I just cannot wait to see what new things I find out on this tour, and I hope you're excited to come along with me. But that's it. No more talk. Let's head on over to the tour. Trike Tours USA meets right between the Winn-Dixie and the Holiday Inn Hotel in the parking lot to the left next to the hotel. And they are surprisingly not in the type of vehicle that you might think for a tour like this. I'm on a ride on a tricycle. We got here early because when we film, I like to be places early, but now I'm anxiously obsessed with every car that enters into the area. Like a watchdog. I was watching for big vans, trucks, and he rolls up in a minivan, which I just thought was hilarious, and it's amazing how much he could fit in there. We got really excited to hop on. We actually were a trike tour, and there were also some people there for a Segway tour, so you can see the Segways are there as well. So there are multiple options for what you can do with Trike Tours USA. You don't have to be on the trike, I guess, if you really want to try out that Segway life. But you'll see if you keep watching, the trike was pretty fun. Our first stop was over the bridge and to the Esplanade where Baron told us a little bit about the real estate and the many shops, restaurants, and amenities near us. We also had a bathroom break there just in case we needed it, but we didn't, so we kept on going. So, so far the trike is super comfortable, but my hand is getting sweaty, which makes it hard for me to throttle. If you couldn't hear me super well, what I was trying to say is my hand was getting sweaty. So it's a little hard for me to pull on that throttle, but that's just the Florida heat for you. Our next stop was right near the docks, like next to the Esplanade, and it was the perfect spot to take photos. The sun was setting and he took our photos while still on a Segway. We got an amazing one. Check this out. He could be a photographer. I think this is a great time so far. I love these scooters. Honestly, I wish I could drive one of these everywhere around Marco. We didn't always stop for our tour guide's information. Sometimes he would just tell us something as we were passing. For instance, here's where Baron was telling us we were passing the Rose Marina, which happens to be where the Key West Express takes off from a four and a half hour Boat ride over to Key West. We also got to run into a little nature. Whoa, that was a burrowing owl. That's so cool, I like fly, isn't it? Yeah. Amazing. They're so pretty in and the evening. They're supposed to be asleep right now, but these are the opposite. Not nocturnal. No, they're daytime owls? They're daytime owls. After a little more riding, we were almost into Old Marco. So now we're entering Old Marco. This was actually all first found in 1870. 1870, wow. Cattle? That's crazy. On an island? Yeah, they would 
pick it up here, then they go to the Naples Pier, and then uh, they pick up another batch and then flip it all off to Cuba. Wow. Pretty cool, right? Out of the Cuba. Hashtag cattle to Cuba. Learn the things you learn on a Segway slash trike tour. As we got towards some of the shops in Old Marco, we decided to park our bikes, take a break, get some water, and see some of the nightlife. Hydrated and refreshed, we went back to the streets on our trikes. It's so pretty right now, the sun is setting. <laughs> I love it! The need for speed! At this point, we were all very used to the mechanics of our vehicles and just really enjoying being on trikes, being on segways, and seeing a gorgeous sunset. Come on, Rose. She just found, she just found, she just found the speed button. Just, I found it right off the bat. And that was the end of the tour. We were back in the parking lot and he packed our vehicles back up into his minivan like some Mary Poppins magic. And we actually went to Sweet Annie's after this because what better way to top off a tour than some ice cream? Okay, so we just finished our tour with Trike Tours USA and we had honestly a super fun time. We're walking back to Annie's right now. I wish I had my trike. I loved riding that trike. It was really, really fun They're for fun. me. Um, I didn't even realize you could turn it up to level three and go super fast till the very end, but I'm not a speed demon anyway, so that's okay. I was going too fast the whole time. Yeah, that's why his brakes were probably squeaking because he's just racing it. But we had, honestly, I had a great time. I thought our guide was like really personable and you could tell he knew the locals. They're hugging him, they're saying hi to him. He knows their names. Um, and he had some great suggestions of places to eat, places to go. Now, of course, because we've been to Marco multiple times, we actually knew some of the things that he was showing us. But for someone who hasn't been to Marco before, I think this would be a great tour to help you get a lay of the land and give you, you know, best tips of places to go and things to do. So definitely would recommend, check out their website. It's in the description below. And then I will put their phone number here as well. And you can go take a tour with them. Honestly, so much fun. Michael, any thoughts? Yeah, just go do it. It's fun. Just go do it. Just go, just do, go do it. it. Just go do it. It could be fun. It was, so, it could, it was fun. <laughs> okay, and don't forget, if you like videos like these, travel videos, go ahead and subscribe. And as always, bye travelers.